Colts fans will get a break on Sunday, but only to get a little more fired up for the big one the next night. Indy goes to Baltimore for Monday night football. Can the Colts keep it going in the right direction after they're getting their first win? Well, Brad Brown has a look at Thursday's return to practice. An extra day to prepare, an extra day to heal up, and an extra day to savor that first win of the season. But for the Colts, an all-important extra day to prepare for another tough opponent. I have a lot of respect for this team. Obviously, they've been good for a long time. Coach Harbaugh does a great job. Um, they're a physical team. They're, they're very talented. They're good on in all three phases. So we'll need to be at our best, uh, but look forward to the challenge. Last Sunday's win at Miami was not a complete performance by any means, but still the best 60 minutes the Colts have been able to string together this season. For us, it's hey, just stick to what we know and what we do best. Take care of the football uh, when we're carrying it. Take care of the ball when we're throwing it. Um, and just be, you know, make a concerted effort. Um, but at the same time, we don't really change our routine on that front because we do preach it all the time around here. Carson Wentz says he's feeling much better and he'll need to as he faces the always tough Baltimore defense. The Ravens gave up just 17 and 7 points against in the last two wins. They're going to be physical. They're going to come after the quarterback. Um, we know you're going to get all that stuff. You're going to get some different looks, some exotic packages, all sorts of stuff. They're going to mix up their personnel a lot, play a lot of linebackers, a lot of safeties, kind of keep you on your toes in that regard. And for us, it's just about um, execution. And then there's Ravens QB Lamar Jackson. The Colts defense will need an ironclad game plan to handle him. They're real diverse. I mean, they, you know, they got that option going. Um, Lamar is, I mean, obviously we all know he's an elite quarterback, but I mean, he's an elite runner. And now uh, we've got to treat him, obviously, like a running back. And uh, this week is all about assignment football. We're aware of the fact that, you know, Baltimore is 14-1 and one in their home primetime games. So this is a great opportunity for us to go on the road and show what we can do in primetime. The Colts are a touchdown underdog for week five. Brad Brown, WRTV Sports.